Hey everybody, welcome back to the show. Of course, everybody's heard of the Chop Shop. They've got a brand yep. new location and we have some great hairdos to look at. Yeah, Daniel joining us, co-owner of the Chop Shop Hair Salon. First That's of all, me, yes, no? sir. tell us about the new space. This is a huge place for we you guys. We have just upgraded our location, 2,000 square feet of the most beautiful <laughs> square awesome. footage you've ever seen. Uh, we have a pool table in the center. Get we out. built a full service <laughs> color bar in it. Um, it is absolutely wonderful. We've unveiled or revealed uh, the ugly secrets behind hairdressing and we brought it out to the customer where they can see exactly what's going nice. on. See what's going on. And yeah. you guys are still on Granville Street. We are so yes. And you guys are having a huge party on Saturday night. We are trying to have a huge party. Yes, we actually will be huge. We have um, our grand opening party after six years. We we feel that we've done a lot of positive work with the community. Yep. Um, we're going to bring in the community as best we can. We have uh, the Vancouver Downtown Business Association going to be supporting us. Nice. We have Joyco, we have Red or, uh, Goldwell supporting us as best we can. Excellent. And and we've got a lot of great little things for you giveaways. You guys Come like on. to party too. I mean, that's the other side oh, of the man. equation. It might be a good party. It's going to be You awesome. know, as we grow older, we just party different. Yeah. And I think, I more think, sophisticated. You know, and that's what we're trying to become a little more as we grow up a little bit. We've, we've shed the old skin and now we're trying to uh, to create a little bit of a new, uh, a yeah. new rebirth. You now, know? we so have some great styles that we're looking at today. Uh, let's start over here and tell us what you've done. Well, me personally, I, I can't take all the credit for this. My uh, wonderful the colleague. Royal we. Well, that's yeah. right. Uh, Toby, who works at the Chop Shop commercial, uh, our Granville is a, a fantastic stylist. And what we did was wanted to display a little more of a classic wow. do for that's you girls beautiful. that are going out to your Christmas that's parties. Really cool. It doesn't always have to be rock and roll. When you come into our shop, we try to make it as friendly and as comfortable yeah. for everyone. And that's our that's. But our it goal. does have that nice, uh, yeah. you know, sort of original look to it as well. I guess, yeah, you know, and, and and that's the whole point. And it's just easy, you know. It doesn't take a lot of time. P products are key. We're not big product pushers in mm -hmm. our salon. It does take a little bit of effort. And it does take a little bit of investment. So yeah. we've, we've brought in a color line. We bought in products that everyone can afford. Right. And we're not pushy about it. It just and takes this, something. this style here doesn't look like it's got a lot of product in it. It's not one of those updos yeah. that looks like, you know, a helmet head. This is still sexy but isn't and that elegant. Part of the magic is using the yes. right product so it doesn't look like you used a lot of product? Well, yeah, but you know what? Product is product. And we all get sick and tired of it being shoved down our throats. Whether yeah. you're going to the grocery store, whether going to the hair salon, <laughs> you're spending enough money in the, in the end anyway, so why not make sure it's the right product? Right. And that's where hairstylists and hair salon owners should start educating the customer and educating their staff on yeah. the proper we're product. The right you don't stuff. need to sell a million things. Just yeah. sell one or two great things. Now you're you gonna buy mentioned it anyways. having a color bar, and we're going to look at this fabulous yeah. color over here. Okay, I'm coming over here now. Can and I tell us behind? about, uh, this. it's like <laughs> the most beautiful color of pink. Well, this is the most beautiful color of pink, and we do use a uh, color called the Lumen, which does not fade. Most of these colors do over time fade. It's yeah. a little harder to get out and it's a little more commitment, but if you are looking for that type well, of Well, I figure hair, if you're going for a look that strong, you're committed to it. She's committed. And, and with the, <laughs> or she's going to be. <laughs> well, and that's just a, She's like, am I committed? I am committed. This is a new generation, and you know, people are getting away with a lot more. And like, at yeah. the end of the day, we have the freedom to do and say a lot of different things that we couldn't say five, yeah. ten years ago. Mm -hmm. So this is slowly becoming the norm for a lot of yeah. people. And in certain cultures, it well, does work. Well, it's an work. extension of personality, style, exactly. like all all those other things. Can we get her right? to turn so, yeah, the side so we can see the beautiful it. cut here too? No, this was done by Gracie. Now Gracie's fantastic. You've probably seen her in the back with all mm -hmm. the hair. And yeah. she really specializes in this. This is a huge, huge job. By the time she started this and finished this, like I said, she had a dreadlock that took her almost six hours to comb out of this. But she did it and without breaking the hair. Now that's why I'm saying use the right product. We use a K-Pack reconstructor, ran it through. It was very simple, not expensive, and we didn't have to cut it out. Nice. Right. It's well, just time dedication. And I'm seeing all the color in there now oh, it's too. Awesome. When I first looked at it, I thought it was just like, a, If you turn around this way, other come, come over here because look at this. Look how pretty it is. It's wow. endless and the attention to detail is just, it's flawless. That's and so that's, that takes a lot of now, time. Now if somebody's going to go for a look uh, that is this edgy, is that something you consult with? Because I mean obviously it's not for, you've got stylists who can do something for everyone, but how do you go about it when you come to the salon? Well it's a commitment. I think it's, a, it's the consumer's obligation to communicate properly. I think us as stylists, we get a bad rep sometimes because the communication isn't done properly. Now that's what my salon really is focusing on in the next little while. It's really customer service based. Yeah. Right. Without it you have nothing. I make sure there's pictures. I think it's just as the consumer's responsibility to communicate yeah. properly. It is the stylist um, obligation to right. give, the, give the consumer what they want. there's nothing worse than getting something that the hairstylist wants and you don't. What's blonde? There's blonde this. Blonde. Like there's 17 <laughs> different shades of blonde and what we've done with a color bar is brought it out so you can actually be a part of, of the experience and you can pick and choose on the spot instead of the secret behind the, right. the carpet right? or, the, or the, curtain. the curtain. That's the word I was well, looking for. Well if you want to go to the curtain. chop Carpet. shop 
their uh, brand new location, chopshophair.com is the website. That's where you can get a look behind the scenes at everything. And if you want to visit yep. them, uh, the new Chop Shop is on Granville Street. A brand new, huge location. Thank you so much uh, for joining uh, us and today. And I want to say the brand new, huge, franchised very nice. uh, location. Nicely so that's done. something we've been working very hard on is putting this product across this great nation of ours. So tune Thank in. You. Watch us on our webisodes, too. We like very cool. Very cool. Very cool. Com. Quick break. And when we return, we've got a great giveaway for the holiday, holiday so don't go away. Okay. So did you want a similar color fee? I, you know.